Inclement weather at the United County Fair has organizers facing some tough decisions. Event cancellations are included. The rain has affected us. I mean, the fair is open. Last night we postponed, we canceled our parade due to the rain and stuff, and we probably shouldn't have, but we did because, you know, you can't tell what Mother Nature is going to do. One minute it's pouring, the next minute it isn't. We asked one concession worker about the foot traffic he's seen at the counter. Actually, nobody's got in any business between yesterday and today. With all that rain and everything, the couple of people that have came through, they couldn't really go on none of the rides because, like, you know, you can't run some of these rides in the rain. Fair personnel say 15 wristbands were sold at the Midway attraction area on Tuesday. Oneida County Fair Vice President Tom Reeder says agricultural community participants are traveling beyond local borders. You know, there's people who travel from Pennsylvania to come pull their horses here. One guy called me from Buffalo last night and wanted to know whether he should come or not. I said, call me at 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, I'll tell you. And here at the grandstand, it's the conditions on the ground that forced the cancellation of horse shows today. At the 60 plus acre Boonville Fairgrounds, the low turnout extends indoors to the traditional cattle and sheep shows. We have definitely seen a drought in the amount of people that have been here. Normally, these barns, the multiple people are walking through them. Elizabeth Shefferstein says fairgoers are missing out on those livestock shows. They just like to see them. They like to see how pe young people get out here and show them and present them and promote the dairy industry. The Oneida County Fair is scheduled to feature tractor pulls and live music all the way to Sunday, July the 29th. In Boonville, Ben Dennis, Eyewitness News.